crib, bought it, crib, got it, got on it. Did I ever ask you to take me to go shopping in Paris or go sailing overseas and just drape me in Gucci? No. Hey girl, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm about to show you how to do your own mink lash extensions at home. Yes, girl, your own minks. Look at these. They're so freaking pretty. Like I just did these. It took me less than an hour to do. Okay, this is a highly requested long awaited video and I'm super, super excited that I am here today. With this video the best part about doing your own lashes at home girl you can make them look however you want to whatever length you want thickness you want how wispy you want like yes so if you are interested in finding out how to do your own mink lashes at home and get them slayed and laid like these like girl what then just keep watching boo so let's get started first i'm gonna show y'all the products that i use so this is the ardell lash tight glue it is a self adhesive and these are the lashes that i use Baba lash off of amazon the length that i like is the double d curl because they're super curly and i like 18 um millimeters and then this is the second pack that i have it's also um double d but these are longer so like 22 23 24s 25s these are the tweezers that I use to put the lashes on and also I picked these up on Amazon as well. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Girl, I'm about to show y'all from start to finish how I do these lashes. It's so worth it. Girl, you're going to love this video. Just keep watching. So I start off by taking off one of the strips out of the box and I'm just showing y'all what they look like. These are super, super curly. These are double D. If you like them curly, get double D. Um, they have other, you know, lash curls as well. But I like to place the strip right on the front of the box. Also, you will need a glue ring. I ordered these, guess where? Off of Amazon. So I got a pack of those. And then my glue, um, sometimes it's cold. So I like to warm my glue up. And so I do this by rubbing it in the palm of my hands. And this just makes sure that um, the glue is like kind of thinned out a little bit because when it gets cold it gets thick so you're gonna put a drop of glue inside of your glue ring just like that i'm zooming y'all in because i want y'all to see this process so you always want to start on clean lashes so i wash my face clean my lashes and i am going in and grabbing um, some lashes now these are not clustered already so i kind of make my own cluster and so i wanted to insert this close up so you can see how i grab them off of the strip so i grab maybe i don't know five or six lashes at a time and you can make your clusters as big as you like them but i like to go in with smaller clusters and you simply dip them in the glue and grow watch this lift your eyelid up and you want to place the lash underneath your real lashes not on top because we want these to look very natural when we're done so i like to place them underneath do not get them on your lash line just put them close enough you know to your eyelid but you want them super close so here i am going in again and i have different angles and different clips so y'all will be able to see it better here in a minute but I'm literally placing it on my lashes. Another tip that I do is when I'm placing my lashes, you can place them side by side, really close together if you like to. But if you notice in the video when I'm placing them, um, I'm kind of just randomly placing them. I think that this gives a more of a natural messy look. I love a real wispy natural messy look but if you're going for the more you know old school cluster lashes really thick look then you can place them like side by side, side to each other but I like to space my out some and you will see me often in this video pushing them up and this is just me making sure you know that they are adhered to my actual lashes but you are placing the lash on your lash hair but you're getting it real real close and as y'all can see right there I had um, a few clusters already put on and when you place them just push them up like I said to make sure that they are sticking to your lashes Come on, fellas, that ain't none of your biz. Got on your 
your body too, you know I'm on your ass today Would you let me hit it thrice if I asked today? She know my state nothing but magic, babe I be swinging it back and forth to you and your casket, babe Sometimes when you are putting the lash on, you will have to move it as you see I am because they kind of try to move before the glue dries. So place the lash, as y'all can see right here in this clip, really close. And then I kind of just move them to where I want them to lay before it dries. I love this Ardell Lash Tight Glue because it dries pretty fast. Um, it just depends. If your room is like warm in the inside, the glue going to take longer to dry. If it's cold, then it's going to probably dry too fast. So just take your time with placing them. This is the best part about doing your own lashes because you get to place them where you want, move them how you want to. I love this, okay? I will never pay nobody to do my minks because baby, I can do them at home. <laughs> Another thing, while I'm doing my lashes, I like to stop and look at them just to see if they're full enough or do I want more, you know, shorter links. Right now, I'm using all 18 links. You can do whatever links you want to. If you want cat eye, of course, you're going to use shorter in the inside, longer on the outside. But I look at my lashes just to see what I want to do with them. And so I figured that I wanted some more 18 millimeter length lashes on my left eye so I just was placing more there I'm gonna spike these lashes out and have some longer lengths too but I wanted <laughs> I'm so crazy but I wanted to make sure they were full enough with the 18s at first so I'm just going in and adding the lashes you know where I see fit and where I think that they should go Okay, so I left this clip in here because I wanted y'all to see that some people might see these and think that they're done. And that's fine. When it comes to doing your lashes, girl, that's the best part. You get to make them how you want. So if you want a more natural look, you don't want them super full, I felt like this was cute. I could have stopped there. But girl, who about to stop there? Uh-uh, babe. So I went in with my longer. These are like the 22, 23, 24s. And I'm going to add some of those in there just so I can have that wispy, messy, I'm that girl look for my lashes. So that's what you'll see me here doing, grabbing me a little bit of glue. And as y'all can see, you just use a little bit of glue. You don't want too much glue. Um, the longer lashes are sometimes a little struggle for me to put on. So I have to put them on and girl, help them stay up. I don't know if it's because they longer, so they weigh a little more and they fall down or what. But take your time and get your lashes to stick. It just takes a lot of patience. That's it. Life until our nights are filled with peace and stress and strife. And that's the blessing that I give from wife and you because you and right here y'all see i took it off that lash and i was like uh-uh let me just try to put it on the other one like sometimes um i feel like when you place the glue they might still be wet so if you go in with another one close by it just don't be sticking so i just went ahead not a big deal i'll come back to that eye and i stuck the i think it was a 23 or 24 i was using i don't know but i stuck it on the other eye instead and as y'all can see it's stuck on there so just take your time as y'all can see these are spikes so i kind of make them a spike because when i pick them up off of the um strip I kind of squeeze them together so all the lashes bunch together so they look like a spike instead of a fan if that makes sense let me know like once i y'all see this video y'all have more questions girl we can go more into depth on how i like you know my spikes and my fans or whatever but yeah girl i'm just going in wisping them out placing the longer ones wherever i feel like i want them at because period because these are my lashes and i can do that so yeah 
The level is just too advanced, the bezel is Tiffany stamp, no grip on my hand. I know that I came with the slide from left to right, but now I don't want to dance. I got too much on the line, too much on my mind, too much ain't enough of my plans. Nike don't pay me to tell you, just do it. They pay me to show you I do it again. Huh? Yeah, I'm in control of the blood. Yeah. You know how poor we get hot. No. Let me make this place go pop. Hey. The grip is over the top. The whip is over the top. Oh. I thought about letting her go. I was in over the top. I can be pale in my casket, make sure I die with a tan, it's part of the brand. I know that I came with a slide from left to right, but now I don't wanna dance. Can I depend on a man? I slide some bread in the jam, that's just who I am. Custom just waving at us from the window, they don't even come on the play when we land. Anyone else will retire, but I'm not content. I wanna bury these niggas like 20 feet down so no one can find them again. It's gotta be scary to witness me carry these niggas around in both of my hands. They stay inviting me over, they say they got bitches, I get there and then it's just. So right here is when I noticed I wanted them fuller. I feel like I had enough spikes in it, but I wanted them fuller. So I went back in with my 18 millimeters and I just went through and filled these babies out. Oh my God, they look so good. Girl, you cannot tell me this don't look good. Y'all are welcome for this video because trust me, baby, my Instagram DMs, lashes, lashes, show, show, lashes. We ain't gonna post a video on your lashes. So girl, here they go. Look at them, baby. You can't tell me nothing. Look at the top. You don't see nothing from the top. Don't play with me. Giving very natural, okay? Cause And just like that, we are done. I hope that y'all did enjoy this video. Leave me any comments or any questions down below. Let me know if you will be trying your own mink lashes at home. I definitely have fun filming this video. Make sure before you leave my channel that you are subscribed. And also make sure that you like the video. Leave me a comment and follow me on my Instagram, y'all. Thank you for watching. And until next time, stay pretty. She wants your name, name.